Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's time for episode 65. Sorry, double checking a few too many extra things. And we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic to the Sith Lords. We are turning the tables on a trap, and we are now in. Excuse me. We are now in the Jack Jack Tar tunnels. And um, it seems we don't have the ability to map our way through this. So we've got a maze of twisty passages that all look alike. For all you uh, map quest people. Um, I don't know if... Oh, okay. Can we recover the mine? The demolition skill good enough? No. All right. Um, I don't. Of course, this is supposed to be one of those mazes that since you don't have a mask, I don't see any chests or anything. Um, you know what? I ain't playing. I'll detonate that stuff from over there. Oh, that's right, because this is supposed to be a gaseous thing. You're, you're not supposed... You're supposed to have to run. Oh, no. There is... There is... There are bodies in here. I mean, loot and stuff. Well, shoot. Now I'm going to have... Now I feel compelled to go through and double check. Sunyan's data pad, sonic grenade, chemicals, and credits. Let's get the item. First, the map goes static. Then I hit a frag charge, tearing my leg... Who placed charges down here? Pharaoh must have set me up, or somebody else is protecting something down here. If I could still walk, I could gather the frag mines, use their beacons to leave a trail out. But there's not much chance of that. Looks like Vaga isn't going to get his spice after all. They'll break down into their chemical components in an hour in these fumes. Oh. Well, okay then. Um... You know what? That, uh, okay, fine. Is it going to be like that? I wonder... Uh, oh, let, let's... Uh, you know what? It worked the last time. Let's do a Night Valor and then see if we can recover. Nope. Okay, fine. Fine! All right, Th this is probably only going to be profitable if, uh, oh. <laughs> All right, where's the body? Then we hang a left, and this should be the door that I'm looking for. All right? No? Oh, bother. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, look at that. A high security door. What is behind said high security door? We are wasting time. We must prepare for the Jedi. Jedi. Be patient, Hanhara. The gas in the tunnels will take care of the Jedi for us. Not bloody likely. Besides, one who does not know the tunnels has no chance of finding the exit. The Jedi will find a way. He has endured worse. How does everybody know what I've endured other than me? You think much of the Jedi's chances. Well, I mean, there's much to think about. Even should the Jedi reach the exit, the door will not open, either back to Jek Jek Tar or here into my stronghold. It would have to be open from the inside, and even if it was, then my guards would do what the gas could not. But enough, as I said, I have a gift for you. Why do I not like his chances on this one? Oh! Uh-oh. Um, that maybe I should have spent a little more time leveling her up? Yikes. Ah, Mira. I'm pleased that my traps did not cause any permanent scarring. It turns out your Jedi friend has decided to come here anyway in search of you. How touching. 
It will not be long before the Jedi lies unconscious in the tunnels, and I will send the UBs to hunt it down. But in the meantime, as boss of the sector, I must pronounce judgment on those who have crossed me, and reward those who serve me. Why do I get the feeling... Yeah, Mira, I believe you know this one, as he knows you. Anhar, I have heard tales of how you ripped humans in half. Indulge me. Ooh, this does not seem good. I have left her armed. I do not want her to die too quickly. Um, hmm. Here we are, far from the eyes of other bounty hunters. Now my debt will be ended. That does it, Hanhar. I don't want to kill you, but I will if you don't get out of my way. Your threats mean nothing to me. You do not have the strength to kill, little girl. There is no one coming to save you. Your Jedi friend is trapped in the tunnels of this place, and soon dead. If you want your bounty, then go rescue your Jedi, but first you must go through me. Mira has become your temporary character. Defeat Han Har, then escape the arena and let the Jedi into Visqua's stronghold. Well, okay then. Mira comes equipped with a rocket launcher which can fire grenades, darts, and rockets. She also does not trigger mines. Well, that's good to know. Uh, oh. Well. Just out of curiosity. Can, uh, oh no, she can't do that. Strength, con, reflex. Let's see, can we equip her with strength? Ooh, okay. Um, accuracy, saves. I'd love to do the defense gauntlets, but she doesn't have medium proficiency. Um. Yeah, let, let's bump up the saves then. Uh, nothing I can do there. Let's get a Mandalorian melee shield handy. Um... 75% versus electrical is nice, but that doesn't help. Defense and dex, that does help. Skills do not help. Demolitions does not help. So let's do that right there. And I wonder, is she, uh, no, that's not the one I want. Uh, feats. Is she the... Yeah, she is the Master Dueling. So I'll leave her one weapon as it for now. Yeah, that, lo that looks to be about it. That seems to be about everything I can do. And what are you blinking about anyway? Sonic grenades? Lydian's data pad? All right, um, so let's, um, oh, Let's see how many of these mines we can get them through. All right. Since she doesn't trigger mines, right? I hear the mines going off. Uh, he didn't take as much as I would have liked. Um... Oh, no, shoot him. Where, where, where's her? Ah, fine. Where's her thing? Plasma torch, negotiator, longsword, survivor sword, mining wave, but... Oh, come on, man. Where's her shooting? Shoot him. All right, 1-8, 1-8, 1-8, 1-4, 1-6, 1-4. Uh, 2-11. Okay. Oh, that's a blaster rifle. Um, 
Alright. Let's see if I can get... F no! No! Why? Alright. Let's, uh... Let's grab a battle stimulant. And let's try to equip something. Like, uh, I don't know. Since she is dueling. I don't need a double laser sword. One to eight, one to eight, one to eight, one to four. I guess I don't really have any good options on this one. Or do I go for the, uh, and stop at one to six? Let's try that. Alright, let's get some distance. Let's knock off a couple of shots. Oh. Let's uh, just keep the distance because engaging in melee with a Wookiee does not seem to be uh, useful to my long-term health. Yep. Just run a little more. Ah, don't just stand there. Oh, oh, that hurt, that hurt. Get the shield up. Okay, run away again, run away again. Running away. does it. Easy does it. Get some distance. Fire. There we go. Gotcha. Hmm. That was unexpected. <laughs> I don't know. I expected it. Still, I have the Jedi, and now I have no need to pay Hanhar for his services. Yikes. I have other entertainments for you, I think. Ooh, um, that doesn't seem fair. I wouldn't mind looting the bodies, too. I'm going to check on the Jedi. I will leave you here with the payment I intended for Han Har. Ha ha ha. Okay. Okay. So he was going to feed Han Har to the dogs anyway. All right, I need to find a way out of the pit and find a way open the stronghold and let the Jedi in. Um, what's, uh, what's, tranquilizer darts. Ooh, there we go. Oh, is this where I'd get the, um, shoot. Rapid shot. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got a funny feeling this is just going to be more of the same. Running around and uh, firing off. Oh. Nope. Oh. Couple of them got to me. I, I wouldn't mind looting those bodies, because I have a funny feeling that those are the darts that I need for her thing, but... Oh, 
Oh! Oh, no. This is about to be bad, isn't it? Yep. Yep, this is kind of bad. That was not the help I thought it was going to be. Still taking more hits than I want to take. I almost wonder if I should have saved the mines for these guys. Oh, because I keep hitting different ones, too. There we go. Can I finish one of these guys off? There we go. Alright, at least I don't have to worry about them using stim packs or something. That would be... That would just be... Alright, there goes another one. There goes another one. Alright. Finally. Come on. Get him. There we go. Oof. Alright, let's uh, finish off these... Pit victims, carry tunneler, credits, and a, a replacement med pack. So he's got nothing. What's he got? Sonic grenades, poison grenades, vibro blade. Um, actually, let me uh, let me turn that off now. And I wonder. Here is ballistic mesh jacket. Oh, yeah, I guess I should have uh, checked on that one, too. Not upgradable. Uh, bonus of five. Oh, because it's got all those damage resistances. All right, that might be worth hanging on to, then. All right, on the offhand, let's go ahead and get... Um, let's see, one to ten. Um, Two to thirteen, five to sixteen. Although, why do I get the feeling that some of these should have been in somebody else's weapon too? Yeah, because I, I think I was going to give that Trandosian sword to somebody else. I'll uh, figure that one out in a little bit. Let's just go with the. Uh, where, where's the? No. Um. Is that it? Two to thirteen. Yeah. Let's have that in the offhand, just in case. Oh, okay. Nothing. 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 Those guys have nothing. This guy has some average frag mines. Why does a why does a hound have average frag mines? Some paralysis arts, credits, and a heavy blaster. Okay. Uh, a med pack? Oh, I wonder. Nope, those are just the mines. I wonder where all those uh, darts and whatnot show up then. Because I should be able to have that, right? Alright, uh, oh. What's over here? What's in this corpse? Sonic grenades of credits? Old Beast Tender Corpse. Ooh. I'm going to need his key card. I do believe that's going to become very, very important. Um, so there should... <laughs> they just left the body in their key card and all. That's, uh... That's something. Alright, what do we got? Can't do a grenade... Okay, so the darts show up with the grenades. Good to know. Oh, okay. So I do still want a blaster in her hands. All right. Um, ben Dock's blaster, that's another one to eight, one to ten. One to four, one to four, one to six. Oh, but that's a rifle. One to eight, one to eight. 
Rifle, rifle, rifle. Alright, let's get the heavy blaster equipped then. Oh, why do we get the feeling that this is not... Yeah. Oh, come on. Are, are we seriously gonna... Are we seriously going to dance this dance? We are seriously going to dance this dance. Alright, let's get another melee shield up. And, uh... Goodness. I thought I was going to be going after these guys with a Jedi. Not with somebody that has, like, no health and no armor. I mean, I guess I could, um, give her better armor. As much as the damage reduction versus, uh, slashing, bludgeoning, and all that goes. And it's, although I guess that might be keeping me alive. All right, round and round we go. <laughs> I love how I'm over here murdering these two guys and dude up there is sitting there stretching. All right. No, nothing out of him, nothing out of him. Fine. Uh, let's go ahead and where's a regular med pack? Because I got plenty of those, and it looks like I definitely need that. Um, so I need to get to the Jedi. Uh, I don't think that's where I need to go. No, that's not where I need to go. Do I have a map again? I have a map again. Oh, and I mapped out almost all of that over there too. All right. So, I guess it's to the sparring room first? Yeah, I think that's my only way through. Alright. Hi! Oh! Hi. I'm just going to exhaust you to death in the uh, arena. I think I'm going to have to uh, engage a shield before I walk into the next place because uh, I don't seem to have time to do that once we get into combat. And I don't think she's going to be able to sit there and tank these guys as they come in. I mean, after all, they're, they're main to... These guys are intended to be anti-Jedi personnel. There we go. Oh, no. Nothing? Nothing. Um... Okay, so that's all of those bodies in there. Let's pop another regular med pack. What is down this side? I'm curious. Stand back. Oh! Oh, crikey! Two more, you guys? Uh... Bother. That's what I get for not following my own advice. Come on. Let's do this thing in the arena. Good and proper. A 
That's another one for me. So far, so good. Just, uh... I'm really not a fan of this particular strategy. I mean, it's working. Don't hear what I'm not saying. I am a fan of not dying. And I am a fan of not losing progress. Um, I think instead of uh, exploring like I was originally going to do, I'm going to take the shortest path to getting a Jedi in here and getting a little more backup. So that way I've got somebody who can tank these fools. And then... And then do some exploring. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, that seems about it. You know what? We've made, <laughs> we've made progress. I don't want to repeat. So let's go ahead and save where we're at. Okay. And um, this is where I'm going to go ahead and insert a cut. So if you're watching on YouTube, you'll see the rest of this place in the next episode. If you're watching on the live stream, you'll see the rest of this place in just a minute. So uh, let me do this. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up live stream archives from some of my other stuff and various and sundry other videos because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, quotes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.